Hello guys, today we are doing a haul video. I bought a bunch of stuff and I'm going to show it to you guys. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Yanni and I'm the creator behind the Acrylic Creative Studio brand where I create soaps and candles. And if you are a subscriber, welcome back. Thank you for being here. I really appreciate you. As you can see, everything has been taken out of the bags. So we're gonna rewind this video and I'm going to show you everything from the beginning. Okay guys, so there is a bunch of things that I've bought uh, these days and I wanted to show them to you. And you're probably gonna hate me for this or be very happy for me. But I went to a local event. It was like a small business owner a reunion so you can network with other uh, creators. And they had like a lot of things that people have give away and they didn't want it anymore. So you could take them for free. And guys, I got a bunch of stuff for candles for soap so i am going to start um showing you what i bought first and then i'm going to show you what i got from the event and i have a bunch of bags <laughs> starting with the pop shelf i don't know if you guys have a pop shelf where you live but i live in north carolina and we do have a couple around and it's kind of like a, like a five below but they have like a bunch of stuff for the house it's really really cool I apologize if you hear my son in the background he's playing and of course yeah mom life so a pop show I bought these little um, like measuring cups this is a five ounce measuring and I bought two of them and I use these for my fragrance oils and sometimes if I'm going to make lip balms since I don't make like a huge amount I make them in these little cups and they are very useful and I also bought some sprinkles these are so 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 cute they have like little clouds and the colors I thought were very nice and um, I'm going to use it as inspiration for my next soap like the color combination I really like so that's that for top shelf like, we use this paper for an order and then I went to the dollar store and bought some measuring cups for the soaps and these measuring cups are different from the ones that they used to sell let's see if I can the spout is like very uh, thin that's how you say it thin it's like it's the other one is kind of round and this one has like a thick and I was thinking of the drop swirl technique I think this will be really good for that technique so I bought two of them and then I bought some frames um, these are uh, like the colors that I like for my brand and I bought some I use these for kind of like a price list at the events at the market and I also like to put like a picture of me with my story and who am I and why do I like to make soaps and stuff like that so people know a little more about me if they want to read it so yeah I bought two of the blue and then I got a bigger one in white that was all from the dollar store and then I bought these from Walmart, this I also use to make my solid perfumes and lip balms and stuff like that. And also when I'm working with Melt and Pour, uh, because sometimes the Melt and Pour that I use, 
dries really fast so i try to and i don't use like a lot to use a big cup so the bigger the cup the faster it dries so i try to use the smaller ones i bought this at walmart and then i got some molds so joan had this 50 percent off coupon this weekend and i've been looking for these molds everywhere because i bought one last year and then i couldn't find them anymore at joan's and they were available and then i used my 50 percent off coupon these were 10.99 so half of it would be 5.49 I bought this one and then my husband used his coupon too <laughs> and we bought two of them so I have two I already had one so yay I want to use these for like face soaps face yeah face soap well, like a smaller uh, soap for the face so I think that's the perfect size and they're really cool brown you know easy to, to use so yeah and <laughs> since the coupon lasted a couple of days i made a pickup order and i bought this now you may be asking what's that this is a silicone and you can make your own molds you just need something that you sorry guys my camera ran out of battery and now i'm crooked okay so we're back <laughs> my camera ran out of battery sorry about that so as I was saying, if, for example, uh, I bought it for my embeds, so I can make my own uh, molds for my embeds. For example, you can grab anything um, to make a mold, or you can make your own figures and stuff like that with clay, and then you can just use the silicone to make copies of that, and then you can use your melt and pour base and use it on your soap. Uh, I do have a video on how to use this on my other channel if you don't know I have an art channel uh, that has 21,000 subscribers and I decided to open this channel because of course soaps have nothing to do with what I was doing over there in that channel so I just opened this one but in that channel I have a video showing how to make a Fruit Loops mold with this silicone so if you're curious about that i'm gonna leave a link around here and in the description box so you can see i am going to be making another video exclusively for this channel so stay tuned for that if you haven't subscribed please do so you get the notification of the new video when it comes out you have to hit the bell to get notifications i forgot about that you subscribe and then you hit the little bell and every time i upload a video it's gonna show on your feed so yeah very excited about that product i think i'm gonna do like some oreo molds i don't know why i'm just being obsessed with that i don't know why i don't even know if i'm gonna make a oreo so but i mean yeah so what else we went to harbor freight i don't know about you but i love going to home depot and harbor freight like i always find things to create i don't know <laughs> tell me tell me if you're like me like every time my husband's like do you want to go to home depot and i'm like yes so we went to harbor freight and that's where i buy my gloves oops so we bought um, the 7 milli, seven milliliter thickness neutral disposable gloves. I got mine in medium. I am a small, but they don't carry small for the 7 milliliters. The other ones that are thinner, they do have small, but I don't think they're going to protect me from the lines and stuff like that. So I'm like, no, I'm using this one even though they're not exactly my size. And then my husband is getting motivated and he's like, I want to make soaps with you. I want to help you. And I'm like, yay. Of course, I love that. So he bought the same ones, but in large. <laughs> so we both have gloves now. How romantic. <laughs> so yeah. And then 
I bought these 12 pack towels you guys you know how much we waste when we are making soap and we use a lot of uh, paper towels and of course I want to reduce um, the waste while creating so I am planning to use these to clean the surfaces and stuff like that and that way I'll minimize the waste and of course these also help me insulate the soap once i put it in the mold i just wait a couple minutes and then i cover them with towels so this is gonna help a lot i think these were 8.99 which i thought was a great price yes they were 8.99 for 12 so i think it's a great price and that's that and i also bought this now <laughs> this is a infrared laser thermometer I've used one in the past from Amazon and I didn't like the results like I couldn't get an accurate reading in my opinion like every time I hit the bottom it will be a different temperature I, I just was very stressed out about that and I bought the ones that are like the candy thermometers and the meat thermometers and I've been working with that for a long time but sometimes when I'm making candles I just have two thermometers I'm making a lot of candles at the same time so I need to be you know I need to check the temperatures and I'm not gonna be like taking the, the thermometer out of one to check the other so that's why I wanted to have this one so we'll check if it works I hope it works it was 20 bucks it was on sale I don't think I have batteries for this so let's see if it works and I bought some bamboo skewers at Walmart this is for guiding the fragrance oil into the measuring cup so it doesn't make a mess around and sometimes to make the designs on the top the swirls and stuff you can use these these are very useful and that is it for the things that I bought and now for the part that you're gonna love me or hate me <laughs> you know what um, I think that it's very important to give I am a person that I love to help I love to give I am not waiting for anything in return when I do that and I think that life uh, rewards you in many ways and when things like this happen to me i i accept it with gratitude in my heart because i really think it is the world speaking to me and in a way saying thank you back so i feel very grateful and very fortunate and very happy of course and the irony of this is that most of the things that i got today from that event were things that I needed or were considering buying in exactly the colors and the sizes <laughs> that I needed them so thank you God thank you universe for this gift and I'm very happy so <laughs> I got a box I don't know if you can see it well doesn't matter it's a box <laughs> So it has eight jars, eight candle jars. Now these char jars are the ones that Candle Science sells. These are the 22 ounces apothecary jars and they um, they don't have the lids. I couldn't, I mean, <laughs> I'm thankful enough for the jar, but I'm gonna buy the lids at Candle Science and I was trying to make different sizes, different candle sizes and all of a sudden, here we go, <laughs> free jars so they are all in good condition so I am going to buy the jars, I mean the, the lids and yeah <laughs> here's the model in case you wanna uh, buy some, it's $70.99 six maybe uh, 22 ounces and I was telling my husband baby I need boxes for shipping um, they're very expensive sometimes 
and I got this package of four by four by four boxes from Uline. It's a 25 uh, package, and they look like this. <laughs> and I was like, I don't know what size exactly I need for my soaps to fit in the box, and you know, to have space and stuff. This will fit exactly, I think there were like five bars in this little box. I'm so happy. Like I didn't have boxes, so here they are. And not only that, they're white, which is like very important for me and for my brand. Like everything is white. So there you go. White shipping boxes. Thank you, thank you, universe. Another thing that I got was this <laughs> I was also looking for these on Amazon um, and I couldn't find the white ones because I wanted them white so I bought plastic ones and then here they are these are the recyclable like the um, let me see I'll tell you right now these are eco-friendly containers it's a push up tube it doesn't say like the material but it's like like I don't know how to say it in English car stuff carton but yeah you push it from underneath and you have your lip balm and it's eco-friendly and they're white now we use candle science fragrances and not only fragrances from Candle Science, but they are 16 ounces, 16 ounces each. This is Japanese Cherry Blossom. I don't know how old these are, but I don't think there's going to be a problem with that. I don't know if these even have a shelf life. And then this is Golden, Golden Santo. And then we have Seaside Plumeria. I'm planning on using these on soap, so I need to share, of course, if they accelerate or you know, have any other things like discoloration and stuff like that. I was also commenting to my husband that I wanted to make some beard balms, but my little containers were pink, and I don't think men will appreciate that so <laughs> I was looking for other color and voila <laughs> so we have black I think these are two ounces two ounces thin tins and as you can see they look like this and so yeah we have a box I'm not sure how many are in here I think they're like 40 the box is just missing one so we have these and the cool thing about these is that I have like the information here I see that they bought them from Amazon so maybe if I need a couple more I can just go here and buy some more and guys this I thought it was crazy that I found this and most of these I'm planning on giving away because I just grabbed these at the end because they were in a box and I couldn't decide which ones I needed and my friend told me like can you just grab the box and I was like okay so I grabbed the box and these are wooden wicks from Bramble Berry I have some other I think these are from Amazon based on the sticker or maybe I'm wrong I don't know and then this bunch right here these are from the wooden wig go okay all of these now I wasn't sure what size I needed but I am definitely going to give some away because there is a variety of sizes here and I don't think I'm gonna use them. So I am gonna pay it forward and 
the ones that I don't need, I'm gonna give away. I also have some clips. I think they're all in here. I mean, there's it's supposed to be a hundred clips. These are for the wooden wicks. This is some more. It says crackling booster wick. Three inches. We have some other brand. And then these are used. We have wax in it. But that's nothing that you know we can clean them. But these are the wick bar. This is the centering tool, I think, for the wicks. And that is it for this huge haul. Let me show you the table. So here's a table with all the things. Um, and as you can see, I'm in a different space and I forgot to say welcome welcome to my new studio uh, from now on you're gonna start seeing uh, this all of this all the time because I am going to start creating here we rearranged the house and we finally got some space to create our soap studio and since our business is growing we decided to have a bigger space so we can create more soap and create more videos for you guys so it's not finished yet I have a huge mess as you can see around me um, and what you don't see around me <laughs> but uh, I've been working on cleaning and organizing everything still there's a lot of things that needs to be organized and um, I cannot work in an unorganized Space. like I, I can't concentrate I need everything to be in its place and clean so uh, we are working on that this week and hopefully I can start creating I have a wholesale order that I have to fulfill um, it's made to order so it's not like I have the things already made but the um, buyer already knows that I need to create more soaps for the Joy Worthy Co shop and and of course i have to create more for the pop-ups so there will be a lot more content coming these weeks and yeah well guys thank you so much for watching i hope you had fun and i love this kind of videos i love seeing what other people buy and i don't know it's just is it weird it's not weird it's so cool right so thank you, thank you, thank you so much for being here. If you haven't subscribed, please do like this video and leave me a comment down below. What do you think of this haul? Do you hate me or you love me? <laughs> thank you so, so much for being here and I hope to see you in the next one.